Pa lullaby. Collected in Pa. Hello, Mrs. Willoughby. Call me Clara. She's in the bathroom. The door is open slightly. Me and Demelzer can see her putting on her stockings. We can't call her Clara. It don't feel right. We both want stockings like that, but we're not allowed. But when I'm 16, I'm getting a pair. She has one foot on the stool as she smooths the nylon out. I'm nearly ready, girls. She's putting on her lipstick now. It's called Scarlet Nights, and they don't sell it in Woolworths, so we don't know where she's got it from. Though I dared Demelza to ask her. She's had her bottle, so she should sleep. Now she's putting on her perfume. We can hear the soft hiss of the spray and see the mist. Sometimes, if she does it in the room, some of it lands on us, which we like, but her mothers do not. Demelzer thinks the perfume is called azure, but she's not sure. You may need to rock her back to sleep if she wakes. And sing her a song. Which song, Mrs Willoughby? Any song will do. Nothing rude, though. Demelzer and me can't sing very well. Demelzer knows Love, Love Me Do by the Beatles, but it's not great for the baby. We've heard Mrs Willoughby singing, though, when we was late once for babysitting. Oh, it was the sweetest sound. There are some custard creams for you, girls. And I put money in the lecky. The lecky ran out last week, so we had to light a candle. There's just this room and the bathroom. Mrs Willoughby's bed's also the sofa. From the window you can see par docks, but not the beach. But she has some lovely cushions. Make yourself some tea, girls. Cups under the sink. Her cups often have kiss lipstick marks on them, which we pretend we made. Demelzer has had a kiss at the school dance, but I haven't. Demelzer want that fussed, as the kisser had been eating chips. But I would quite like to try it. Good night, my honey. Be good for the girls. She bends over the cock to kiss her girl. Then she brushes her cheek. She loves that girl. Not sure what time I'll be back, girls. But you'll be all right, the two of you. Yes, Mrs Willoughby. She leaves. We listen to her high heels going down the stairs. She's on the top floor. I don't know how she gets that pram up and down. She's got a radio, so we listen to that. The baby wakes up, so Demelzer sings Love, Love Me Do, which makes her cry. So I try Row, Row, Row the Boat, which seems to work. We all fall asleep. I hear laughing and two sets of footsteps coming up the stairs. Hers and some heavier ones. The door creaks open. Shh. Hello, girls. How's she been? This is... Roland. He says. Roland. She says. She looks in her purse to pay us. Roland? He takes out a pound note. We haven't met Roland before. Last week it was someone else, and the week before he was called Maurice, and he was French. French kisser, I bet, said Demelzer. She kisses her girl and puts a shawl over the cot. Thank you, girls. Next week? But we can't go next week, as our mother has found out about them being different men each week, and won't let us go. Dad said... Oh, don't be harsh, Martha. She's just trying to keep body and soul... But Mum wouldn't let him finish. I felt sorry, so I put a note through the door, but I don't know if she's got it. I think she's moved. Golden slumbers fill.